What's up guys, Rudy Linnell. I'm not going to show you any Python code today or in this video, but I do want to kind of show you this cool, interesting, and fascinating thing. Uh, if you do some reading with SymPy and uh, the module online, it does note and kind of direct you to this cool Wikipedia article for Richardson's Theorem, um, which is all about equality and how you can't really prove two equal things are equal symbolically. So, uh, check this out, this Wikipedia article. In mathematics, Richardson's theorems establishes a limit on the extent to which an algorithm can decide whether a certain mathematical expressions are equal. It states that fairly certain natural class of expressions, it is undecidable whether a particular expression E satisfies the equation E equals zero, and similarly undecidable whether the functions defined by expressions E and F are equal everywhere. In fact, e equals F and only e if, only if, sorry, E minus F is equal to zero. Now, this was proven in 1968 by computer scientist Daniel Richardson of the, uh, the University of Bath. Man. <laughs> I'm not going to give this guy any shame, but, I mean, University of Bath is pretty cool. Like, if I could go to the University of a shower, I'd go. If I could go to the University of Hot Tub, man, <laughs> that's all my money. You know, here it is. Take it. Take 12. Take 20. Now, I'm not going to read any more of this to you guys. I just think it's cool. I mean, being part of the programming world, being part of this intellectual sphere, you can emerge with mathematics and science and really, really cool stuff. So I just wanted to show this to you. Uh, kind of an interesting mind thing. And, uh, oh man, Daniel Richardson's been deleted. Well, I mean, hey, University of Bath still gotta be open, if you know what I'm saying. There we go. <laughs>